Peace and blessings. Peace and blessings, family. Yo, check this out right here. <sighs> Y'all already know what it is. Check this out. Look, man, if you ain't got it, you ain't got it. I don't know why everybody is out here running around here to all these stores. I'm talking about lines all in the stores buying all this stuff up. Buying in and everything. Y'all know we are in a pandemic. Don't nobody have any money. And there's no need for you to pretend like you got money. You are going to put yourself in debt. And it's funny how we can go buy all these things during this time of the year. And then go into debt and to be all sad and mad when it's all over with. And I know a lot of y'all saying it's kind of hard for me to talk to some of y'all because y'all say, well, I'm going to make sure I get my kids whatever they want. Hey, that's good. That's fine and dandy. Get your kids some things that they're going to use. Some things that they're going to use. Don't go buy your kids nothing that they're going to play with for one week or two weeks and then just put it in the corner. Man, people are getting put out of their houses. People are losing their vehicles. Some people don't even have food in their refrigerator. I'm telling you, you better count it all joy. You better count your blessings. If you got money like that, you better put it up for a rainy day. This pandemic is still going on. Why are you going out here buying all of this miscellaneous stuff that really doesn't even make no type of sense or that is shallow? Because at the end of the day, when you go buy that $100 game, guess what? There's a $100 bill that need to be paid. And if you can't pay that $100 bill, guess what? You can't go to the electric company or the, to the utility company and give them that game. They're not going to take it. They want cash or they want a credit card. Stop spending all of your money up. If you ain't got it, you ain't got it. If you don't have it, you don't have it. You can sit down and have a sensible conversation with your kids saying, hey, it's kind of tough this year, but I want to let y'all know that I love you. I'm going to do what I can. And that's it. You don't have a point to prove to nobody. Everybody is out here struggling. Everybody. So if you ain't got it, you ain't got it. Man, let me tell you, the greatest thing about this season right here is love. Give some love today. You don't have to buy all this materialistic stuff to show somebody that you love them. Tell them that you love them. Not only that, show them that you love them. Your kids understand. They will understand you by the love that you give and the good conversation and the good counsel that you give. They will understand it. You would rather for you know to tell them the truth than for you to be evicted or put out of your house or then your car get uh, 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 repossessed and then they don't have a ride to school. Or they don't have a place to lay their head. All because you trying to do something and be something that you're not. And I'm just keeping it real. Ain't nobody got no money out here. I'm telling you, nobody has money out here. We in a pandemic. So think about what I said. If you ain't got it, you ain't got it. It's hard to show love to your family. But you know what? Love is an action word. And you don't have to always use materialistic things to show people or to tell people that you love them. Think about what I said. Peace and blessings. You ain't got it. You ain't got it.